from Canelo. Stunned. He is all over it. He is out on his feet. Uh, Romero fought, won, and afterwards had a shirt that said Ryan Garcia ducking me. Why did you wear that shirt, Romero? <laughs> yeah. No, this guy. Es puto Pacquiao. I'm here for a reason, and there's no other reason for me to be here apart from win. Not about. Yeah. 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 You, you, you get my point. For the unified super middleweight championship of the world. Of course, also in the United Kingdom. Good Canelo is going to do or what I think he's going to do. However, after all the trash talk Billy Joe Saunders has given us, I think we're going to knock him out. Dollar right hand, best punch of the fight. Billy Joe says, come on. Now these are heavy blows from Canelo. He's putting lots into these shots. Straight right hands. Now he's throwing more power punches. He's certainly settling in. Right hand from Canelo to the body Ooh. as well. There's the uppercut, and he nods yes that time. Mouthpiece. Saunders shook it off. Sticks his tongue out right now. That's a tight uppercut from Canelo. Been eight or nine. If Canelo is going to rely on power punches, 68-66 Canelo. He's only two rounds up. Saunders took. You see Canelo land the blow. He's like a matador. Well, that's the power from Canelo. Countering back. Nice. Nice. And it is over. They have stopped the fight. They have stopped the fight. It is over. Canelo gets the knockout. consisting of 20 fights, 20 victories, including 11 wins by knockout, 62 victories, including 53 knockouts, and undefeated for a decade. A but he's making it pay, Tim, early on. Oh! oh no. Kulev is down, and this could be it inside the first round. Left or stunned, absolutely stunned. He is all over it. He is out on his feet. Survive this. The crowd are going berserk. He's over and done. That is it, surely. He isn't going to survive. He is all over the place. The referee to 443. It isn't a bad Back when 12 rounds. There's another right close for Rand, as has been calculated over the. Expected him to try and get close up to. Oh, look at that right hand, and he's wobbling again. Oh, the American fans are watching. There's the left hook, and he's down. He is not only has he got that straight right hand. Right he's hand wobbling no again. Well. There's the left hook. He's got position that we've seen in a ring. A glitch. The ring, I'd like to see Pulev get elevation. It is all about payback, and he is making Pulev get payback, and he isn't far away. Oh, look at that left hand again, and that is it. Surely Pulev is not going to get up from that. He is out, it's over and done, and that is a stunning conclusion. Just when you thought that Pulev was on the brink, maybe of catching him. It is lights out for Pulev. The winner by knockout victory, and still heavyweight champion of the world, Dr. Steel Hammer, Vladimir Settle and Wad Gear. Sanctioned by the California State Athletic Commission, the three judges appointed Rudy Butter. Red, white, and blue, he weighed officially 131 pounds. In 28 professional bouts, his record stands at 24 victories, four defeats, four wins by way of knockout, 24 victories, including 17 knockouts, one defeat, and two bouts even. Good luck to both of you. The question is... Today you're going to get to uh, inside. Night. See, but he also has two options. What he said, and they, you know, said it to both of us. But team to be fighting, you know, he's going to break through the wall. That's what he's trying to do. And someone who's trying to break through the wall here is Beto Duran, who was in the corner of Bandido Vargas. What was the part of the plan? Because he's cut other fighters up throughout fights in his career. Want to get him early if he can. He cuts Zaka in his corner or not. 
former world titleist. One. And now from Bandido Vargas. Trying, but he sort of loses. Every now and then, Zaka has his moments where he goes battle because that's Bandido Vargas. Continue. Can he continue? Which he hasn't, Bernard. He's, he's getting pummeled. Bring, oh, he got hit with a right uppercut. That's a right uppercut that drops Rod Salka. It came after a low blow. Four, five, six. Cuts, but it's one thing to say it. Zaka retreats going backwards. You can take him out. said, I am a supposed to. When he do get him in, in trouble, he throw punches like this with common. <laughs> We have your winner by KO victory from Mexico City, Mexico, El Bandido, Francisco Vargas. Get him the shirts. <laughs> Are there two shirts on it? Yeah. Oh. What's behind it? What's behind the shirt? Um, it says Ryan Garcia. Ryan Garcia. Uh, Stop running. Stop running. That one is Ryan. If uh, Ryan Garcia really want to fight me, uh, he will sign the contract uh, before I leave in, uh, in LA. Romero fought, won, and afterwards had a shirt that said Ryan Garcia. Document. Why did you wear that shirt, Romero? Because I want uh, to give the fans uh, that what they want. They said that they want to, they want me to fight uh, King Ryan. Then, uh, 24 years old, but Garcia turning pro at the age of 17. He is only 21. He is the that gold medal springboard in him. Doesn't have that. He's a very good amp pedigree behind Multiple junior national, 200 amateur wins. Hard right hand that landed. Duno, Garcia able to land that right now. He's down. He goes right hand in the hook, and Duno is hurt. Duno is hurt bad. Wow, it's over. That's a superstar performance right there, Brian. Two WBC Silver and NABO Lightweight Champion, King Поставить что-то Виталию Кличко. Вот как я уже говорил, 17 боев, 15 побед, 9 уступов. 40 нокаутов. И 45. И 43. Вот это надо делать с человеком. А? Доводит с самого начала. Кличко плохо. сильный. И по возможности доказать так все ярко и вот очень, очень красиво. Он... Что сантиметров на 10. Скандал. Это ходил к любимым своим соперникам. К любым соперникам. Как радуется и снова. зритель. Он где-то неплохо, а то и правый оперход на непроходимую стену. Здорово. Да. Точный правый при... э, Успевал уходить. Да, то да, сейчас, удар, кричав примерно того же, что и при... При этом необходимы вот эти качества. Да. Ну вот. Я реально вижу, он вот пропал. Вот плохо, еще Ушел, раз. Ему будет посложнее. А, наверное, не боксер, а человек. Потом... Может быть, остерегается, потом останавливается, да, удерживает джебом, а потом вообще... <свят> вот попал, попал сейчас. Клинчи спасается. Да, 4 минуты всего. Он будет извиняться. Да нет, он может еще на... Наверное, всех стран. Бой окончен. Ну что же. Also the winner by unanimous decision and still WBC heavyweight champion of the world. Ну да, Рука. два Рука. раунда по-прежнему пытается сделать. Давай минут. еще пару раундов, говорит Чесора. Usyk grins his back towards the ropes and begins to score with an effective single phase attack, but short of the mark, and now beginning to bring up a crush through the middle. Bearing that gum shield in that maniacal grin that he put, has caused Hook to become just a little bit distorted downstairs and upstairs from Alexander Usyk. What a left hand, what a combination, and Hook backing away. Usyk, Alexander Usyk exploited it and he started the fist showboating in evidence.
defense and scores with some straight punches. Contest. He's being fought at a terrific pace. Usyk back on the front foot now. Inside the distance. As Usyk gets onto the front foot. Hooked out by Hook. Did the same shot once again. But now here comes Alexander Usyk. And Lohan. Outside the of the Muhammad Ali Trophy. As Usyk again touches his elbows. And then he gets. But in the event that the contest is a draw. A fourth draw. Alexander Usyk. Left hand success. And then a sneaking underhand left. Hook in real trouble. And the momentum of search from Usyk. Alexander Usyk has sensingly vulnerable position, but it appears to me as he's put under pressure from some accurate punch picking from Ike's professional contest. Marco Hook again. With many of the punches in that combination to cannon on defences. Two punching range, scores with a right hand upstairs, then one side of the ring near Usyk's corner. Furious assault being launched by Alexander Usyk. Is he not fighting his way out of the corner? Uppercut ripping through the middle. Robert Bird Usyk working away furiously. Shots underneath. Robert Bird has stepped in and has waved it off. In the tenth round of this contest, Alexander Usyk makes a successful third defense of his WBO cruiserweight title. And still the undefeated. arma la grande en el Alamodón. Y ayer pues me, me, me llegó ya pues al... Professional record, 21 victories, including 18 knockouts with only one defeat. And one record, 27 victories, including 18 knockouts with only one defeat. And... Give me a clean fight, una pelea limpia. Okay, and remember, no one is more professional than I. Let's do it. Looks like the 13th round of the last fight. Kind of punches particular. I've done that whenever he does punch. Another hard left hand. You saw between rounds that he's trained by dropping his hands. And he rips Vasquez with a left hook lead. And there was a perfect example. Can he finish him now? Another great by Alvarez to try something. After having been out of the first three, but it's another left hook from Donaire. Or only five for Vasquez. There's one the last couple of rounds in my opinion. Donaire comes. Right oh. when it comes up over the three. Well, Larry. There's kind of left. Good shot. Oh, what a couple of punches. Tremendous uppercut. And the left hook to put him down. And running really down all the time. That's leaving himself open without leaving. The opponent, and to a certain degree, found one tonight. He's been hit. He's 29 years old. And see what happens. You know, I would like, even though he may. One who's been so excited about the prospect of what Domir can do, for instance, at 126. The Filipino Flash Bonito Donia! <laughs> Así no es cierto que, que Tony ha subido con algo ilegal y la verdad así va a ser. Vamos a darle más el paqueo. Julian, who's gonna win? Paqueo o Margarito? Margarito. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Who's that? No puedo. No, this guy. Puto. Es puto paqueo. <laughs> así es. Professional record: 38 victories, including 27 knockouts with six defeats, 51 victories, including 38 knockouts, with three defeats and two bouts even. Antonio Margarito has said that Manny Pacquiao better be ready for war. Pacquiao always is, and so are we. Margarito's arms and head down. Well, what a fighter. Margarito has thrown almost six jabs in the first business fight that I see right here. Is this fight you can see right here. But speed belongs to Pacquiao. And so he rallies back there. Selectable experience, perhaps, Margarita. Manny Pacquiao looked vulnerable. Good play. 
Now his back is against the ropes. Margarito tries to press the axe, and Pacquiao hits him flush with a big left hand. And then flurries and backs Margarito off again. He has no power. He can't hurt me. Talking about Pacquiao. Now the marks begin to show on Margarito's face as he has a big red welt. Under not hurting. And Pacquiao is beginning to land with almost every punch. He's, all around the ring. Yeah. he's beating Margarito up in this round. There's a huge welt under Margarito's right eye. See the left hand shot to the bottom, which I think started all of the serious problems for Margarito. Even though he was being outpointed, seemingly with that shot, he never has recuperated. This doesn't this moment that Margarito has oh, like his fight against Cotto. And here comes Absolutely, and, he jolted and, and, back, or jolted Margarito with the left hand there. Pacquiao staggering Margarito momentarily. And beat him up that way. It's impressive, he said easy, the footwork. As he's tasted for a moment the advantage of having Pacquiao against the ropes. This is Pacquiao's nightmare. It's called comparative rounds. I thought... This is the best offensive fighter I've ever seen. He does it all and fights everybody. That's what I like about him. You can see it possibly go in a 12-round decision only because... I thought Pacquiao... And here comes And he Manny. turns it around and bangs oh. Margarito. That badly brutal fighting. Very strong goal. He's never stopped fighting his fight in spite of a frax the way we used to see him knock out. I talked to Miguel earlier today. Miguel said he's a little better than a smaller guy. But a regular 140 pounder, I think Manny would have knocked out. There was another left hand rally by Manny Pacquiao. Unless somebody wants to stop the fight because of that. He's a former flyweight beating yeah. up one of the biggest welterweights we ever saw. Yes. Made athletic commission to make Margarito shave off the beard, which probably they would have done. Pacquiao said, leave it there. I want to use it as a target. Unbelievable machine. Greatest offensive fighter of the era. Tattooing pork Margarito. That's what he's ready to go. That's one of the biggest running left cross. Another measure of redemption for Margarito. Even for the fans, rather. Look at me, I'm tough. He really wants to win the fight, even though he's hopelessly behind and no, getting no hit. Landed a shot, looked toward. But the referee's doing a good job, I think. It's, it's right that you change, because as long as the guy's punching back. If the referee stopped, there wouldn't be any complaint, but I just seemingly was doing that with Roy Jones in the later rounds, too. And Manny Pacquiao, the cultural icon. Manny Pacquiao, the citizen of the world. That's the man who's letting... Uh, and we're done. All three to the winner by unanimous decision. And now winner of his eighth world championship, the fighting pride of Serengani Province, Philippines.